two points is two points. Um, and so we have to walk away and take that in, in the long, grand scheme of things. Um, so I think that's real important for us to understand. So we, we, we walk away from that at, at, on a positive. You know, we just feel like we had a slow start, and we want to try to rectify that. Sure. So you start off the match a little bit differently. Typically, we don't see this from CFC. A long ball would have everyone on one side. Uh, what was the idea going into that? Was that specific to this game, or was it just something new that you guys wanted to try? Yeah, we, I mean, we, we, the thing is, right, we're a new team, and we're still really trying to, like, find our way and find the right rhythms and find the right pieces and parts and the right combinations of players. So, yeah, we um, we definitely, you know, we definitely try a few different things. And so, you know, this is part of it. Um, two changes to the starting lineup, uh, Sarsar and uh, Garcia Sosa, they made their first starts today. The last time they started was against Atlanta United uh, about a month ago. Uh, what went into this decision? Was it uh, game-wise or just um, tactically? What was the yeah, a little bit of both, right? A little bit of, um, again, looking at some things that, you know, we wanted to have a little more stability in the back line, a uh, little bit more control of the game. Um, but um, overall, I think, um, you know, and we're, we're 11 games into the season and we're a new team and that we've, even though we're 11 games in the season, you know, a lot of, a lot of our guys, right, got in late, didn't, didn't go through preseason with us and all those things. So we're still, we're still trying to put it together, but we got to give guys chances to play. So that's, you know, what we try to do. Uh, first half wasn't the prettiest performance. Uh, just tell me what were your thoughts on specifically the first half performance tonight? Yeah, we were, we were sluggish. One of the parts of our game is pressing the ball, and we didn't really have much of a press of the ball. So I think that's something that we got to really uh, – we have to target and, and get ready for next week, you know, and um, credit to the guys, right? They worked hard. They fought, I think, toward the last maybe 10, 15 minutes of the, of the first half. We really started to click and put some pressure on, and the second half we came right out, and we were pretty dominant and obviously getting away late penalty. We don't like that. We missed the penalty – you know, so. so you said uh, toward the end of the first half, you were starting to see some more success. Did see some more sustained possession. Did start to see uh, some of the chances. What was uh, that like? Uh, how was that encouraging to y'all? And what went into halftime? Or what was the part of the halftime talk? Right? Yeah, the halftime talk was just to talk about our press mostly, get that right because we feel like we get that that press right. We'd have more of the ball. We win the ball high up the field. Uh, we could keep them pinned in a little bit, and that's something that was working for us, so we wanted to continue that. Certainly did get it working. Two minutes into the second half, he got the finish off of a good cross, and it was Milo to get the finish inside the box. Uh, what was the reaction from you and on the sideline when uh, you guys came out and started so well? Yeah, I mean, look, we, we've set a standard, and the standard is we're fighting against ourselves. We're not fighting against anybody else. And um, we will continue to take that. that and so that was just part of us pushing ourselves, pushing ourselves to the next level. And we get the goal, we pushed it, you know, to go 2-1. And just disappointed we didn't get the full three, but you can't complain about two points. Yeah, speaking of two points, you ended up going into spot kicks. Specifically, the first three uh, PK takers were all defenders. Uh, how often do you guys prepare for these scenarios? And what was the idea of having three defenders start off? Which typically is just not what we usually see. Yeah, it's not positionally as much as it is uh, – what guys show the confidence because penalties are about confidence. Pen penalties are about believing that you can do it, and we train it. And tr we we do train it. We train them, you know, because obviously this league, every game you can do it. So um, we are, um, yeah, we are. We just go with the guys that we think and think that can do it. We had three CFC greats inducted into the Hall of Legends tonight. How has their impact really made CFC what it is? Today? Well, we don't sit here. We're not having this conversation without them. So all respect to them, all just like you have to, in sport and in life, wherever you go, you need to know the history and respect the history. And hopefully you, you propel that history forward on the foundation that people created before you. And over 4,000 Chattahooligans showed up tonight. 
what do you have to say to all of the fans that really made tonight very memorable? And this is, look, I've been to a lot of places. I've been in a lot of uh, stadiums, and it's great to see the city really support us, and we hope we continually give them something to cheer about, and that's really something really important for us. We want, look, we, we don't do this without the fans. Um, they are a big part of why we, as a, as a club, set a standard to really, like, be the best that we can be, and we want to reward them for their support. Is there anything that we didn't talk about that I might have missed or something that you would just like to add? Yeah, look, the fans, I mean, obviously they are excited. They are really, they give us energy. They give us, they give us the little push that we need. And I think it's, it's, it's important for us. It's very valuable for us. And I hope that continues. What's it like when you make that change to Alex and it's just an instant spark? Yeah, I mean, we know what Alex can do, right? And, um, you know, this, the, the, the prior game, the other game that didn't start, it did the same thing when he came on. Um, and he's just, he's, a, he's an important player for us. Alex, wouldn't, Alex was his fourth year with me. He wouldn't be with me for four years if he wasn't, if he wasn't important.